It's like a 75 minute history lesson. Did that feel like a natural fit for Broadway? I started doing this in clubs, you know? And then, I mean, they get it, they'll stay, with, they'll stay with you for about 30 minutes and they're like, all right, come on. Can somebody talk about the lower half of the body, please, and hurry? <laughs> <laughs> we get it, you're smart. <laughs> well, Jerry, you've been following this comedy for a long time. I was thinking the other day we were talking about it and uh, what, you know, why we've worked uh, well together in this and, and I came up with that I'm very smart about being funny, and he's very funny about being smart. So uh, it was a, a good uh, blend of skills. I kind of challenged him to come up with a form, and he did, and then once he did, I was kind of stuck getting involved with it. <laughs> Has the show changed coming to Broadway? Have you... Yeah. yeah, we have a whole new set and a whole new... We have, we're just rewriting stuff as we were talking about backstage. Right. And, and we got this jacket. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's true. That is the big... What's, what's he like as a director? He's great. I mean, he really gets into it. I thought, I thought he would just be like a figurehead. Uh -huh. You know, I thought he'd help with the writing, but then he actually gets out there and has all these great like stage moves and stuff. Just gets up like a real director and it's like, hey man, you gonna try this? <laughs> Starts walking around. I'm like, that's really funny. You know, uh -huh. like all this interesting stuff. How'd you know how to do that? I did a sitcom in the '90s. And, uh... <laughs> like, uh, uh, yeah. like Larry uh, King. I'm not familiar with that. <laughs> 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 Did you ever direct episodes of Seinfeld? We had a director, but he was very open to us all contributing, and Larry and the actors, and we, it was kind of a commune the way we directed that show. Uh -huh. uh, do you think America right now is an empire? Or a failing empire? Yeah, a failing empire, sure. We used to be the one everybody looked up to, and now people still kind of look up to us, but it's not really exactly the same. The fall of empires is about the inability of people to handle success, and you could look at that on a national or level or as individuals, most individuals don't handle success well. And why? And what what trips them up? This show is sort of about just how human nature just steps in every time and ruins everything. You talked about the Greek financial crisis. Or do you plan to I'm stay topical? Sure. Yeah, sure. No, it definitely. I mean, that, that's the thing. We're leaving room for, uh, they keep telling us we have to lock the show, but we're always like, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what we enjoy is like, I mean, we've rewritten this thing, what, I don't know, a hundred times, and yeah. you just keep, throwing in jokes and changing stuff, and the show will be changing throughout the run. I mean, you guys actually like the process of yeah. it. Yeah. Right. Yeah, we don't want it to end, you know. I mean, at some point it'll end, mm -hmm. but yeah. it's fun to keep playing with it. You know, it's like a, like a car that you want to keep tuning it. Because then if it's an HBO special, then you got to write a new one, because now everybody's sore. <laughs> <laughs>